Greetings fellow and future star citizens, Greyheaded Gamer here, and we are back in Arena Commander. Vandal Swarm, single player, but this time we're we're gonna be in a Hornet Trainer. Uh, we get it free for a week, so I figured what the heck, let's give it a shot. Um, I've been having a blast in my Aurora MR here lately, so I went ahead and re-equipped it. I uh, have a bunch of weapons that I bought for my uh, little size 1 weapon test, but I also picked up a couple size 2s, and uh, I decided to drop a couple of those onto the Hornet. Now, the top ball turret, I'm running the 007 Bulldog Repeaters, like I guess comes standard with it, but on the wings, I replaced the Gatling guns with some CF-117 Bulldog Repeaters. It's the size 2 repeaters, and then I went ahead and put my Omni Sky 3s on the nose, and decided to take her out for a spin. Now having three banks of weapons, holy crap, close combat, it's all over. That thing is amazing. And using a couple of the size ones mixed with a size two, it doesn't draw the power out real fast so you can really get on the trigger and not have to worry about much. So that's got me thinking. The Aurora with its single bank of weapons, it's really tough uh, in a dogfight. So when I have my uh, Aurora CL when the universe drops, I'm gonna have my cargo missions covered. But if something happens and I want to help escort an org member, uh, the one starter ship is really going to hinder my gameplay as far as helping friends. So I had a lot of my viewers say, why not multiple starter ships? You know, it would still be starting with the common car of the universe. I've given it a lot of thought and I'm thinking that might be the way to go. Uh, not anything special, just start with starter ships. And with the Mustang, I really believe they are going to be released with the December 19th live stream. That uh, Mustang Delta is really starting to call my name. That could be my little fighter ship. It's still a starter ship, but it looks like it's going to be well equipped for dogfighting. And then, who knows, once the MISC ship is released, I might be able to get my Explorer or maybe a little uh, mining ship. I don't know how they're going to work the variants on that. You know, I'd still be able to support with uh, funding as far as buying starter ships, and I would be starting at the bottom still, but be able to have a few paths to take. So I'm really starting to lean towards this, and, and it's thanks to my viewers who put the thought in my head, and it is true. Why limit myself right from the beginning, even though I will still be starting from the bottom, but this will give me a couple different paths so I can still play with my friends and do my little cargo missions at late at night by myself. So we'll have to see how it goes. But let's talk about this damn Hornet. This thing is nasty. It, it's a tank compared to the Aurora. Three banks of guns. Holy moly, this thing is a beast. I am absolutely loving it. It changes Arena Commander like you would not believe. And if you can't tell, this is the first time I've ever played a Hornet. I, I've always had access to it with, when I had my Freelancer Max, but I've never just really messed with them. Uh, back when Arena Commander first dropped, I think I flew it and the 300 a little bit here and there. But I just wasn't into Arena Commander. So I'd play for a minute or two and then I'd shut it off. And I was really waiting for racing to come out. And then once racing did come out, I uh, was flying the 300 a lot. Uh, tried the Hornet in the racing, but that's also a lost cause. But in Arena Commander, Vandal Swarm, this thing has won me over. I love the Hornet. So I'm thinking that once the Gladius drops, I'm gonna. That's probably gonna be my go-to ship once in, uh, I can earn it in game, uh, because it just looks so sleek and it looks like a badass fighter. Also. So anyway, guys, just wanted to get out there, play a little Arena Commander, and I just want to say that uh, the CF-117 Bulldogs are nasty. So if you don't have any, pick them up. They're 8,000 ECU. Uh, I think it's a good deal, especially after spending 12,000 ECU on those uh, Om Omni Sky 3s. But just another way to uh, support the game. Get out there and buy you some guns. Uh, we're probably going to have some new guns dropping with uh, Arena Commander 1.0. So if you want to wait till then, have at it. But I'm having a blast. I hope you guys are too. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out all the Star Citizen YouTubers out there. Uh, thanks to all my my patrons on my patreon page you guys are making a huge difference thank you so much for your support and i will see you guys later